Hello everyone, my name is Arshan and I'll be reading to you Fancy Nancy's Hair Do's and Hair Don'ts by Jane O'Connor. Fancy Nancy's Hair Do's and Hair Don'ts by Jane O'Connor. And the pictures are based on illustrations by Robin Prius Glacier. Do not forget, tomorrow is picture day, Miss Glass reminds us. Reminding is fancy for making us remember something. I also have a surprise. Here's Miss Glass telling her class about her surprise. What do you all think her surprise could possibly be? Ooh, ooh. What is it, asked Clara. If I told you, it wouldn't be a surprise, it says Miss Glass. You will find out tomorrow. Goodbye, I say to Miss Glass. She didn't need to remind me about picture day. It is just about the most important day of the school year. So here's Miss Glass talking to Clara, it looks like, who asked the question. And this is Nancy waving goodbye to Miss Glass and her friends. Weeks ago, I put a circle around a day on my calendar. Weeks ago, I picked out my outfit. Outfit is fancy for clothes. I will wear my pink shirt with ruffles, my purple skirt with ruffles, my pink and purple socks with ruffles. Ruffles make anything fancy. Here's Nancy showing where she marked on her calendar, marked on her calendar about picture day and her showing us her beautiful fancy outfit. After dinner, I read my library book. It is about Amelia Earhart. She was a brave airplane pilot. Amelia was not fancy, but I like how she looks. Her hair, most of all. Her hairstyle is called a bob. Then it hits me. I have not decided on my hairstyle for picture day. Here's her reading her library book about Amelia Earhart. And you can see her own hair. My hair is curly, so I can wear in many flattering ways. Flattering is fancy for pretty. Maybe I will wear my hair in pigtails. Maybe I will wear my hair in a bun. Maybe I will wear my hair long and loose. Just then, Brie calls. She describes her outfit for picture day. Describe means to tell about. Then she says, my mom braided my hair into and put it in new beads. Oh, how elegant, I tell her. What do you guys think elegant may mean? Fancy Nancy does tell us. She says, elegant is fancy for fancy. Maybe I will wear cornrows like Brie. Here's her friend Brie wearing her cornrows. But mom does not have time to make lots of braids and dad is not a good braider. Later, I read more of my book. Then it hits me. I will wear my hair like Amelia. Ooh la la. That will be perfect for picture day. Amelia's hair was shorter than mine, but I can trim my hair. Based on the pictures, what is the reason that you think that Nancy's mother may not 
have time to do lots of braids. I snip a little here, I snip a little there. I snip in the back and I snip in the front for bangs. Here you can see where Nancy's hair, her little curls are on the ground. My bangs are crooked, so I snip some more. Trimming hair is very complicated. Complicated is the opposite of easy. I am still snipping when mom comes into my room. Nancy, what are you doing? Scissors are only for cutting paper. That is a Clancy family rule. Nancy was just in her room cutting away. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, really, I am. I just wanted my hair to look perfect for picture day, I say, but it looks horrible. Mom tries her best to help. There, your hair looks fine. She is trying to comfort me. That's fancy for making me feel better. I can't go to school tomorrow. I can't be in the picture, I say. But mom says, you are not missing school because of your hair. The next morning, I come into class. I am wearing my fancy outfit. I have tied a scarf around my head. It does not look fancy. It looks odd. What do you guys think odd could be a fancy word for? Miss Fancy Nancy tells us it's fancy for strange. Soon it is time for the picture. Lionel and Brie are next to me. I wish I were invisible. Why do you guys think that Nancy wishes she was invisible? What happened? Miss Glass says, you all look wonderful. Now I will show you the surprise. She has caps for us. The caps say Miss Glass's stars. Do you want to wear the caps for the picture, Miss Glass asks? What do you all think that Nancy says since her hair is not the fanciest right now? Yes, we shout. I shout louder than anybody. Quickly, I unwrap my scarf. I put on the cap. I do not look odd anymore. I look almost normal. One, two, three. We all say cheese. And for the moment, that's fancy for right now. I look picture perfect. P.S. I hope I have fast growing hair. So there's Fancy in her class and Miss Glass with their little caps that were the surprise from Mrs. Glass. You guys are probably familiar with taking pictures like this on picture day. And in the back of the book, Fancy Nancy leaves us her fancy words vocabulary. These are the fancy words in this book. Comfort means to make someone feel better. Complicated means the opposite of easy. Describe means to tell about. Elegant means fancy. Flattering means pretty. Moment means right now. Odd means strange. Outfits means clothes. And reminds means to make us remember something. The end. That was the end of Fancy Nancy Hair Do's and Hair Don'ts by Jane O'Connor.